What's up everybody and welcome back to my circle where I give you guys an inside look into my life. So on today's episode, I'm going to be taking you guys behind the scenes to show you what it looks like to take care of five kids while your wife is away on vacation. So sit back and enjoy the show. Oh, I couldn't wait to share this one. Any moment, he will take you for waiting on it to walking in it. Cheers to no more surprise babies. <laughs> Regardless of what you're going through, it won't last forever. Our marriage is goals because you don't just fall into goals, you work for it. You and that's our story, and we're sticking to it. Have a blessed day, y'all. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to my circle. As I told you guys in the intro, I'm going to take you behind the scenes and show you what it's like to take care of five kids while your wife is away on vacation. So we've already kicked off day one. She got up early at like three something in the morning to leave. Uh, some friends picked her up for the airport, so I didn't have to get up for that. So that made it a little bit easier. I wasn't sure how the morning was going to go, but it actually went pretty smooth. So the boys are actually in school right now. Uh, the girls are down for a nap. Aubrey's actually watching Miss Rachel or Blippi in the other room. She goes back and forth between the two on her tablet. So uh, she's pretty chill. Uh, so I'm going to wake them up here soon and just have lunch and get the girls started uh, before we have to go and pick up the boys uh, from school. So sit back and enjoy the show. What? What's your color? Okay then. All right, let's get it. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. Can you pick it up? You gonna help out? I got it. All right, better be careful, it. It. Be careful with it. Be careful with it. Be careful with it. Really? 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 Tell him again. Really? You, you done? Yeah. Yeah? Ooh. Oh, Asher, this is nice. Oh, dang. Dang. Double-sided. Oh, look at that. That is nice. Dang. Just welcome home, pumpkin. Oh, what you doing back there, girl? You want to read? You want to read? It says, my form friends. You want to read it? Let's read it. You got to open it if you want to read it. Open it up. There you go. Then we can read it. Turkeys can be very friendly. Turkey, tur tur turkey, cat, c c cat. Can you say cat? Day? Say cat. Yeah. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, let's do this. You know what time it is. Come on, don't even fuss. There you go. There you go. Come on, come on, let's do this. Let's do this. You know what time it is. Come on. There you, where you going? Don't run, Lily. Come on, let's do this. Where you going? Hey, get back here. Get back here. Get back here. Good night, baby. Good night, baby. Sleep tight. Yes, no, I don't think we can, said B. But at least you've had a little rest. And it's all downhill from here. 
So we're wrapping up day one with our mom. She's away on vacation. And I'm happy to say it was a good day. Uh, we stuck to the routine that we usually have. Uh, the only thing that I did switch up, I heard somebody say like kids shouldn't do homework right away when they get home from school. So I decided to like, why not? It sounds like good advice. Uh, and our kids usually, usually come home pretty hungry. So I was like, you know what? We're gonna try something different since mom away and it's just take the pressure and the stress away of trying to do everything. Uh, so I just decided to like let them fix what they wanted to eat uh, and just have free time. Go and play and do whatever you want to do. And uh, I think it worked out pretty well. We ended up doing homework around six o'clock and Riley has this book goal uh, that he has to read for his, cl for his class. And I think it's like maybe uh, 50 books for this month and try to read as many as you can. So he was able to read two books and he was excited about it. And we was able to FaceTime mom right after he finished. So she was able to ask the questions about the, about the books that he read and not just so him skimming through the books. So he's actually getting and learning and being able to retell the events of those books. And he was able to do it. So uh, that was a good moment. The girls did pretty good. They uh, missed mom as usual. Lily, I don't know, man. She has this attitude that I feel is coming on. So I'm curious to see how things work out with her. Lundy is happy-go-lucky, so she's always happy. Aubrey had a pretty good day. Uh, she was more chill. She's always clinging to me anyway. So uh, she was pretty chill. Asher, he was excited. He got home from school. He's a ladies' man now. So when I picked him up from school, I had to remind him, like, hey, like, this isn't a high-speed chase. Like, you need to come to me when you see me. Like, you can't go tell all the girls... Uh, bye and then go play with your friends. You do have siblings that we have to get out of this cold weather that's coming on us now So uh, but everything worked out well day one went pretty smooth I think as best as it could so I'm interested in seeing how the rest of this uh, time works out uh, And I'm just I do miss my wife like we spend 24 7 together So uh, just with her being away. I know this is well deserved She needs this because she, ha she haven't had a break in such a long time uh, so I'm pretty sure she's enjoying herself, uh, but we do miss her and we do love her. But at the same time, we have to continue to make sure that we, you know, stay the course and just enjoy the time that we have here together uh, with just dad and the kids. So uh, day one went pretty smooth. I'm curious to see how the rest of this plays out. So you guys have a blessed night. Let's eat some breakfast. You ready? Dad got you some good food cooked up, don't he? Mainly fruit, but... Let's go, Lily girl. I mean, Lundy girl. Rise and shine, sleepyhead. Rise and shine, sleepyhead. Hey, you can't stay up all night and try to sleep in in the morning. That's not how it works. You're going to be up in the night, and you have to get up in the morning. That's how it works, girl. It's time to get this day started. Your brother's already in school. Your sister's already eating breakfast. You're the only one left in bed. Because you want to be up all night. Listen to Miss Rachel and Blippi. Well, it's time to get up and get this day started. We got to pick up Ob's. You ready to get your sissies? We had to get your sister in there. We're gonna get her out so you can eat. We're gonna get her out. Tell her, Lily. Tell her, Lily. Say, we're gonna get you out, sis. We have other siblings we have to take care of. We have other siblings we have to take care of. Tell her, Lily. She drank a whole bottle, and now she's mad, and she want to get out first, and she don't want to think about her siblings. Tell her, Lily. We're gonna get you out. Is it funny now? Is it funny? Yeah. Yeah, I know. I had to get out of the car. What do you think I was doing? I didn't forget about you. It smell like your butt stink, though. Now, you ready? You ready? You ate a whole bag of chips you didn't share, and you wonder why she's crying. Because you didn't share with her. Look at you. You got crumbs all over yourself. Yeah, she didn't share it with you, did she? She just ate it all by herself. And she didn't even think about you, her twin sister. And you trying to go get her crumbs. You girls hungry? Should we get some food? Should we get some food? Okay, let's get some food. Let's go. What? 
What? What? What? You miss mom? Come here. Come here, baby. Come here. Aww. You miss mom too? You miss mom too? Come here. We miss mom. She's gonna be back. She's gonna be back. Listen, listen. Didn't I just say I had food coming? Didn't I say I had food coming? Didn't I say I had food coming? Didn't I just say that? You couldn't wait? You couldn't wait? You couldn't be patient? Huh? You couldn't be patient and wait on your food? Didn't I say I had it coming? Yes or no? Didn't I say I had food coming? You're not yourself when you're hungry. That's why I had to hurry up and feed you. That's yours. <laughs> oh, you, you you doing better now since you ate something? You much happier since you ate? Are you happier? Yeah, are you happier since you ate food? Oh, you watching Miss Rachel? You watching Miss Rachel and you happy? All it took was food. Yeah, all it took was food. But we gotta keep you girls fed, don't we? Yeah. Uh oh, she's doing the floss. Do the floss. I wanna see that work you did, girl, because you fell asleep in the car. Who did your hair? Who did your hair? Did dad do that? Yeah, it looked good. Yeah, tell me about all this work you did, girl. Tell me about this work you did right here. Look, tell me about it. What you did? What is that? Paint. You paint it? You paint it with this one? Oh, show me the next one then. Oh, what is that one? Oh, what is that? Did you do some cutting? You did some cutting? Yeah. Oh, show me the next one now. Ooh, I'll sit this one up here. I think, show me the next one. Whoa, what is that one? Whoa, is that a car? Yeah. And you did that? Yeah. By yourself? Yeah. That's really good. Whoa, you didn't show me this one. Show me this one, tell me about it. What is that one about? This one. You call it that one? Yeah. It's pretty too. Hey, did yeah. you have fun with Laura? Yeah. What all did you guys do? Did you go to the park? Yeah. Did you go to the beach? Did yeah. you go to the, you didn't go to the beach? Mm -hmm. It was too cold to go to the beach. So you just went to the park? Yeah. Hey, hey, are you glad I brought the stroller? Yeah. Yeah, cause I forgot it last time, didn't I? Yeah. Yeah, all right, pound it. Wow. <sighs> Should we go get your brothers? All right, let's go get them. What? The Reese's Hey, can you tell me what this is? What? This. Me and you. What? It's not. That's me and you? You drew that? Yeah. Wait, it's Father's Day? No, he just loves his dad, don't you ask? Yeah. Thank you, bud. Can I have a big hug? Love you, buddy. Hey. What, how our handshake go? We gotta do our handshake. Is that what you do? Yeah, let's practice again. Okay. One more time. <laughs> We pick mommy up on the weekend. You pick mommy up. Pick mommy up? Yeah. Yeah, mama got like four more days. I love you too. No, I got it. No, guys, I want to hear it. Watch out. Audrey, I don't need help. Can't do it. Oh. What 
What is this? It says... Um, small woods? Yeah. What is this? What is it? What is this? It's a picture. A picture? I know what it is. Yeah, we gotta take a pictures first. Yeah. I want to take picture, Dad. You wanna take a picture? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna use this box. I don't want. What you doing, Alps? Hey. Sweet. Your baby sleeping. You getting the baby to sleep? Yeah. Okay. Should I cut the lights off for? Okay. What you doing? <laughs> you got my TV on? Yeah. Yeah? You Wait. trying to find Miss Rachel? No. The baby don't need Miss Rachel. Arby says she's going to sleep. All right, I'll cut the light off for you. I think Okay. I got going to sleep, Dad. Huh? She's going to sleep? Why she gotta go sleep in my bed, and not your bed? Let's get baby just sleep in my bed. Okay, that's a good point. All right, who ready to go to Pizza Ranch? Let's go Pizza Ranch. Huh? All right, let's go. I thought she was already on the way. Is it good, Alps? You were waiting for her. Oh, is it good? Okay. Hey, crime baby. Is it good? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How good is it? Very good. Really good? Yeah. At his school? Yeah. Don't you ever dare cry again. Okay? What you tell her? Don't you ever dare cry again. Don't cry again. Don't you ever dare fly again? Yeah. Cause this is some good food. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> That's your dad. Who wants some? Yeah, look, dad. No. No, you don't want no chicken. Are you sure? What are you doing? <laughs> Alright, so day two without my wife. Um, it was a little busier. Uh, the girls, I mean, they got up, stick to the routine, get up, breakfast. Uh, made sure to feed them a big breakfast to keep them uh, full just a little longer. And also just to keep them happy. Um, Lily, this attitude is just, like, that's her personality. Uh, I feel like she has my personality. And London has my wife's personality because she's happy-go-lucky. Uh, Lily is mischievous. Uh, she's reserved, so I mean, she don't say much, but she watches everything. Uh, and when she wants something, like she has to have a way. So uh, that's kind of showing right now. I think it's just because she misses mom. Aubrey actually went uh, to her great aunt's house today, so she was able to have fun. She got out of the house. She do it every Thursday. Go over, just do arts and craft. They they live near uh, a lake, uh, so they was able to go down and play, not in the lake, but by the playground. Uh, they have a pretty good community over there. They have a lot of amenities for the kids. So uh, she was able to have fun. So they wore her out. So by the time we picked her up, she fell asleep in the car. Riley had practice today. So, I mean, that did um, force us to kind of get out of the house with all the kids. But it was good because kids were able to have dinner at Pizza Ranch and just play for a little while, burn some energy while Riley went to practice. Uh, he enjoyed practice. He had fun just getting out playing with the kids his age and also doing something that he's come to love right now, which is football. So day two overall went pretty well. I mean, we still do miss 
Uh, my wife and their mom, we miss her a lot. But like I said, she deserves the trip that she's on. Uh, she's having fun. And, she, and it's great just to be surrounded by those people who are just going to give you new ideas, fresh ideas of how to do this or how to do that. And who are just going to speak life over you. I think many times uh, we miss that. Uh, but until you're in those communities where you have those people that you can lean on to like when you need a word, uh, when you need somebody to lift you up, you have those people. So it's good to see her back uh, in that community where she's just surrounded by so many powerful women. Uh, we're happy for her. We're hoping that she's enjoying it. I have to tell her, like, you know, you don't have to text me all the time. Like, you see me every single day. Like, literally, enjoy yourself. Uh, you deserve it. She wanted me to go with her, but at the same time, we have five kids. And it's hard to, like, put five kids on anybody. Day two went pretty well. A little busier than usual. But like I said, one of the main reasons we want to move back here to South Dakota is because we have help. And I think in times like this is when that help shows and you know, you have people that you can count on to step up and step in when you need them to. And Carrie's mom's doing that for us, her, her sisters. And Carrie's mom's doing that for us. Uh, her niece is doing it, her sister is doing it. Uh, and also her aunt and uncle is doing it as well. And also her, her dad as well. So uh, we just thank those guys for the help that they provide for us and just really just being there uh, when we need them the most. And they're just letting us know that we can count on them to help out when needed. So uh, yeah, you guys have a blessed night. All right, Riley Asher. It's day three without mom. What do you miss most? Helping me do my homework. Helping you do your homework. That's a good one. What do you miss most about mom since she's gone? She doesn't help you. Dad does. They both. We both do. And she can't play video games with me? That she can't play video games with you? That's a good one. All right, let's go. This What? What? Are you ready to get up? You ready to get up too? Yeah. See, you playing around. You got these big diapers. All right, let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go get breakfast. Tell her, come on, Lily. Say you want food, you better come on. Let's go get breakfast. Let's go get breakfast. Let's go. Let's get breakfast. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. So it's day three with our mom while she's enjoying a vacation. <laughs> And I think it's starting to kick in. She's not having it this morning. While Lily's still over there, chumping down on her breakfast. This girl been a little whiny. The boys are off to school. You heard their reasons of what they miss about mom right now, so. Yeah. Bridge with grandma, so y'all pray for me. Listen up. I know you guys miss mom and you're ready for her to be back, but there's nothing we can do about that. She needs a break from you guys. So all we got is what we got. And you're gonna give me no no talk back today, Lily. We need each other to make this happen. So cheers to a good day. We need each other. No uh, hey. No talk back, I remember. Is that your show? Is that your show? Wow. What? 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 I love you too. Whoa, is that your favorite show? Yeah, yeah. Dressing up for Halloween is so much fun. Yeah. <laughs> what you doing, Lundy? Hmm? Trying to steal my food. Did y'all eat lunch in school? No. Both of y'all eating cereal? Yeah. No. No?
You ate your snack fast? I ate everything on the bread. Oh, no. Did anything exciting happen in school? Mm-mm. Hmm? Mm -mm. No? What? Ash. Dad, Any why did you call me Jack? I mean, squirt. Did anything exciting happen for you in school? Me? Huh? No. Oh, I thought you said you learned some. That's enough milk, no. buddy. Dang. You gonna yeah, start chipping in on that milk? Fires. You gonna start chipping in on that milk? You say you learned about firefighters? No. You did? Yeah, I did. What you learned? About bats. Bats. I already been learning about yes, bats. Yes, you said we need to come up with a fire plan, don't we? Yeah. We gotta figure that out. Hey, some bats drink our blood. That's the um, vampire bat. Do vampire bats drink our blood? Yeah. Nope, oh. they drink animals' blood, so you didn't learn about bats. What happened today outside? Today outside? Yeah, what did it do? Um, snow. It snowed. It is. Snowing. Friday, October and the 14th. And the girl's face faster. And it snowed outside today already. Mm. And mom's enjoying that good weather in Punta Canta. Yeah. You miss her? Yeah. Me too. Somebody else miss her too. Yeah. Is it yummy? Sit down. Sit down. Is it yummy? Yeah. You said that's a hot. Yo, it's a hot. She said hot. She said hot. Oh, she's running backwards. Oh, oh, you're out of bounds. You're out of bounds. You're out of bounds. Oh, you are out of bounds you are out of bounds oh you going to play? Are you going to play or eat? You going to play? Go play then. Come look over here. They go on to play basketball over there. out there playing? It's too cold for you girls. Okay. You see him? Where's your brothers? They left you? They left you? Go to the back back there. Back left. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Bye. Hmm? Yeah. Whoa. What you spend your money on, Ash? This toy. Oh, what is it? Batman. How much it cost? Um, eight dollars. Eight dollars. How much? How much money you have left? Five. Five. Yeah. Oh, what you spend your money on, Ra? Mr. Chocolate, Mr. Chocolate, and a Dream Coca Cola. Right. Oh, what? Really? Mr. Beast Chocolate Bar. I should know we're not opening yet. 
Oh, Ash, what you say in the store when you spent your money on that Batman? I'm risky for a biscuit. You are risky for a biscuit? Yeah, yeah we got you a lot of milk. Because y'all drink a lot of milk. Wait, did you buy all that? We bought all that milk for you guys. How much did it cost? $2 each? Yep. Two, four, six, eight, ten. You happy? Ten dollars of milk. Yep, it's that's how much much. milk they drink. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, I hey, open it. Hey, was that money burning your pocket to spend? No. You sure? Because you wanted to spend it. I have seven more dollars in my Dad, pocket. Dad. Oh. No, no, that's not opening. Oh. You just rip. See that? You just like. That looks so good. It looks so good. That. I mean, I. I'm. Hmm? Share divorce. I want to take a bite. Mm. How, how much that cost? Two dollars. Is it worth two dollars? All right. That's Ash, Dad, smell it. Smell it. I want to smell, smell it. Like smell like chocolate. I want to smell it. Smell like chocolate on the ash. Yeah. You can have a bite. Ash said, risk it for a biscuit. Is Say it again, good? Ash. Risk it for a biscuit. Let's go to bed. Come on. Let's go. Oh, oh, we forgot our milk. Let's get the milk first. Then we go to bed, all right? Get our milk first. Here you go. There's your blankie. There's your blankie. Okay, 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 okay. I know. We're going to give you some good night music. Look at that. How peaceful that! Hey, 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 hey! Daddy, love you. Hey, 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 girl. Daddy, love you. Yeah, you okay? Just lay it down, okay? You okay? All right, Lily, I'm watching you. Yeah, I love you. You don't have to go to sleep, but you better not get out of that crib. Love you. I know. Sorry, baby. All right, so it's Friday, day three without my wife. And it's been a pretty long day, but it's been fun. Aubrey stayed over uh, with Grandma last night in Laverne. So we were just me, Riley, Asher, Lily in London. Uh, and it wasn't too bad. Uh, the boys at school, so I mean, that took up most of the day for them. Lily in London, pretty much. And, you know, we stay home. Uh, four times so for me it's like you have to you have to make it fun somehow uh, so they've been I've been feeding them a lot more my wife usually gives them more bottles uh, but I was like you know what you got you girls are drinking too much milk uh, so I just fed them a lot more breakfast lunch and dinner big breakfast big lunch big dinner and they've been seeming to enjoy that I guess food makes everybody happy because they've been much better uh, and they've just been uh, just letting them play and just burn out some of the energy uh, but it's been a fun day. Uh, something strange happened today. We saw, uh, well, I saw while they was napping, snow flurries. It's, I mean, it's October. Uh, I wasn't ready for that. That's one reason I didn't want to move back to South Dakota. Uh, but you also need help. So it's like you got to compromise somewhere. So I guess winter just took a back seat to having that help. So, uh, But it was a little frightening to see this already starting to snow. Uh, when I picked Ash up from school, he was like, Dad, did you see what happened today when I was at recess? I was like, uh, what happened? And he was like, there was snow. And I was like, I know I had to go outside because I thought it was raining. But I was like, that's a little too light and too white. And I had to literally go outside and check and it was snow, uh, snow flurry. So uh, he was excited about that. Uh, he was actually in recess outside. So he got to see it too. Uh, he also texted me uh, after I picked him up from school, like, do we have a plan in case we get a fire? And I was like, dude, what are you talking about? And he said the fire, the firemen came to the class today and just talked about all the things and showed them, I think the trucks and their equipment and told him like, you always need a fire plan. So he helped come up with a fire plan on what we gonna do. Uh, and the one main thing he said is like, if, the, if a door is closed, do you touch the knob or not? And I was like, oh, you have to get out. He was like, no dad, if it's hot, that means it can be a fire right outside your door. So I was like, you know what? 
you you come up with the plan and I'll we'll carry it out according to what you think we should do. So, uh, but it was a fun day. I actually ended up like I said, the girls drank a lot of milk, uh, so we was running low. So I was like, you know what, let's make a trip. So we went to Walmart, me, uh, the girls, and Riley and Asher, and they been look, they've been earning money and that money has been burning their pockets. They've been so ready to spend it. So I was like, you know what, we have to go and get more fruit and more milk for the girls. So you guys can bring your money and get whatever you want. And they picked out some things. Right Riley ended up not spending his money. Well, he did spend his money on, uh, I forget the chocolate bar that he's, M Mr. Beast chocolate bar and a Diet Coke, I want to say he got. And Asher picked out this one toy and I was like, dude, do you do you think that's worth your money? I don't think it is. And he was like, dad, sometimes you got to risk it for the biscuit. And I just, man, I bust out laughing at the story. I said, risk it for the biscuit. I was like, you know what? That's your money. You earned it. I'm not going to tell you how to spend it, man. You risk it for that biscuit. So he did risk it for that biscuit. So, And it was a good night. They We came home, and the boys actually played with the girls downstairs. They had a good time. They don't usually play together like that, but Riley likes to be hands-on. He likes to play with them. Uh, so they had a good time, and we just finished the night off, man. It was such a good night uh, with the five of us, and I'm just surprised how well it went. It's been, like I said, a long three days, but it's been pretty fun. We've made the best of it. And like I said, the number one reason we moved back to South Dakota was to have that help. And having that help, man, is just having people that you can count on. Like, you can't pay for that. So uh, we're just so excited and so thankful and so appreciative for the help that we have. And we, we, we miss mom, but we're going to let her enjoy her trip. And we're just going to continue to finish out these set, these long six days doing it together as a family and just growing closer as we continue to bond. So you guys have a blessed day.